Hello. I can now um, basically just hide my screen for as long as I'm having problems and then open it up again when I'm no longer having problems. <laughs> so it's pretty nice. I totally didn't have any problems starting up this game. It worked perfectly the first time. As you can clearly see. Oh, tomatoes here. Sorry, random stranger. What have we got going on today? Relive. What's that spirit memory? Uh. Oh. No. Oh, yes. Bubbles. Blowing bubbles. Admire the sapling. That one. Oh, in the prairie. Interesting. And brook. Okay. Cool. That shouldn't take too long. Yeah, sure, the first time. <laughs> Starting off with the sass already. I see you, tomato. Hi. <laughs> the first thing you do, the first words that I hear from Tomato are sass. That's fair. Ugh. So many <laughs> gifts. Um, and I'm only adding on more people. I added um, a couple more friends yesterday, so it's it's truly never ending. Surprisingly, though, <laughs> you and your happy emojis. I see you. Um, surprisingly, though, I have had trouble a couple times with doing the missions that require 
friends to be online if I'm ever playing this outside of like a stream. I'll have like a hold hands with a friend requirement and I'll get on and I'll be like there's no way I could possibly not get this because I have so many friends. Statistically, one of them will have to be at on will have to be on at the time that I'm doing this. And no, somehow everybody will be offline. <laughs> and then at one point I can't remember, maybe it was over the weekend. Might have been over the weekend where that happened. And, um, oh my gosh, I lost my train of thought. What was I going to say? Oh, right. So for one of the missions on one of the days, it was like, hold a hand with a friend was your mission. And I was like, okay. So I went on to do all the missions and that was the one that I couldn't get. And I was like, ah, it's fine. You know, if you miss it once, or if you miss one mission, it's not the end of the world. You'll still be able to get everything for, like, the season and everything. And I was like, yeah, I'll just leave it and then see what tomorrow's missions are. So then tomorrow's missions came, and that same mission was still there. And I was like, you're kidding me, right? I just skipped this exact mission yesterday. I don't know if that's a thing that they're doing now, like making you do those missions that you missed. I can't imagine that's something that they're doing. But I was just like, I can't believe this. What are the odds? Yes, so this is one of the missions. <laughs> Cute. We're just gonna beep at each other for the next minute. Beep beep beep. I'm starting late today again. I got... I always get distracted, and sure enough I got distracted again. So it was mostly just like getting stuck in conversations with people. But I at least want to do dailies today. Yay! We did it! <laughs> Success. <laughs> oh no, I cut short your emoji. Harv is playing New Horizons. Nice. I'll play New Horizons eventually. I think... I think what I'm going to do tomorrow is probably stream uh, Deltarune and do the No Mercy route because it's almost Halloween and we gotta do something spooky. That'll be my spooky thing. I think that's as spooky as I'll, as I'll do. Because <laughs> I remember doing that in Undertale, the No Mercy route, and being very upset. <laughs> it was horrifying. I might be on and off at the moment. No worries. No judgments. Oh, wait. The... Bubble spirit isn't here, I don't think. I'm just gonna check and make a little sweep over here just to make sure. No. Okay. Just wanted to be sure. Can I squeeze through there? No. So how is everybody else doing today? 
It's fine over here. It's very pretty outside. Yay! Easy. Easy mission stuff. We're gonna make it look easy today. It might not be speed running fast, but we'll make it look easy. Oh, I hope Tomato's not AFK for too long. Oh no! And they're standing in the rain. <laughs> If you could travel anywhere in the ocean, where would you go? Um, where the sea bunnies are. I would want to see sea bunnies. Where the sea bunnies are. Smiley face. I am a simple person. <laughs> cool. What else we got here? Altriax. What did Altriax say? I don't know. <laughs> Very good, Altriax. And to the USA, India, Vietnam, etc. Oh, Jada. The irony, because I would love to go visit Italy. And that's where Jada lives. I cannot read that. a good... well, wait, hang on. The question was the ocean. Where would you go in the ocean? Not where would you travel all over the world. <laughs> I mean, I guess you could go visit the oceans in the U.S. Maybe. <laughs> um, which one is the um, Bluey Bubbles one? I have the feeling it might be in the next area, not this area. Definitely not that one. So I think my sound effects are a little high, so I'm gonna turn them down just a bit. Come on, there we go. Now, I'm not much of a traveler myself. I'm pretty much like a homebody. I like to just be at home. I'm comfortable where I live because uh, my family and my friends are here. So there's not really too much reason for me to be traveling around in a lot of places. And like, I would certainly enjoy traveling more if I had the money to do so, but that's not an option for me. So there's not much of a point for me personally to travel because I don't really have the means to and I just I don't really have much reason to because again, I'm not really um I mean, unless I'm traveling with friends. That's kind of my... Or, you know, when I do end up traveling, it's like, okay, well, I'm going out of town to see a friend, or I'm going out of town to see a family member, or I'm going out of town because uh, my friends want to travel to X place, 
and I'm going with them. But not because I personally, you know, just want to go somewhere. And I haven't really met that many people in my time who are who share, I guess, a similar point of view to that. Most people that I know are like, oh my gosh, how can you possibly think that way? I want to travel everywhere, I want to go to all of these places, blah blah blah. I don't know. And my brain just doesn't work that way, I guess. That being said, I would... I have like online friends kind of spread out in a lot of different places. So if I were to travel, I'd want to go visit some of them. Which would entail like a lot of like European countries and stuff. I just I don't think that I'm like particularly special travel costs money exactly I don't have the money for that so it's just not gonna happen sorry I don't particularly consider myself a uh, like a unique person or anything I don't have money yeah me neither it's okay, tomato. I feel ya. Um, but there are some things where I really just do not feel the same way as most people that I know. And one of those things is like traveling, and then another is um, like drinking. It's so normalized everywhere uh, to drink. Um, and people cite, you know, all kinds of reasons. Oh, it tastes good. Oh, um, whatever. It makes you feel good. It, um, or like social drinking. Oh, I'm doing it because, you know, my friends are doing it and I have a better time if I participate in it or whatever. And I'm just like, no, not even then. I'm not gonna do it, not even then. Because I don't buy it. Every time I've tried it, it always tastes awful. It's expensive. I don't want to get drunk. I don't want to lose control of my, um, of myself, I guess of my actions. I don't want to act embarrassing and then remember it the next day and wish that I had never done that. I don't want to drink too much and get sick. Like, there's just nothing in it for me. There's no appeal. And I don't understand what the appeal is for other people. <laughs> We'll find this one, but I don't know where th the other one is. I don't know. I I'm of the opinion that as long as you're having a good time and not hurting anyone, then like, whatever you want to do is fine. So like, my life is probably super boring to some people. Because I mostly just stay at home, I'm not adventurous. 
I do some of the same things like every day. It's really not exciting, but I enjoy not having an exciting life. So, there's no harm in it. I do have a friend. I need to ask her for an update. But we want to plan a trip for when we turn like 30 as a like, oh, we're turning 30, we're getting old. It's kind of a milestone, I guess. Um, and we want to go like out of the country. Uh oh. <laughs> this is not good. Okay. I'm burning my way out. Yeah, staying home is the best, right? It's great. I love it. You don't get in trouble. You're not in danger. You're comfortable. You can have your friends over at your house. You don't have to spend money. <laughs> it's great. I'm too poor to do that other stuff. <laughs> Staying home helps with stress, right? Yeah! Like, people will pay all this money to go on vacation, and the vacation itself is supposed to help you de-stress, but usually it ends up causing more stress, because you have to make sure that you get everywhere you want to go on time, and you have to travel to all of these places where you don't know where anything is, you're not sure what's going on, you hope you're going the right way, but you might not be, and you end up more stressed out, even though, again, you're supposed to be relaxing. <laughs> Oh, that, that was weird. I skipped the cutscene, and instead of this going to the next one, it just... Oh, that's why. Someone beat me to it over here. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me again. That coffee I had yesterday did not sit right with me. So I don't think I'm gonna get coffee that much anymore. Today I didn't have coffee though. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're good. No worries. We're just chillin' today. Oh, right, that's in the Daylight Prairie. I was like, I was just gonna look around, but I did not find that anywhere. It's because it's not here. <laughs> it's in the prairie somewhere. We can look around in the prairie after this, I guess. We already got five candles, though, so that's cool. Not even, like, intentionally speedrunning the game or anything, but we're getting through it pretty quick. I still have to go out and get Halloween candy so I can pass it out to the kids over the weekend. Maybe I'll do that today or tomorrow. I used to go trick-or-treating, but definitely, I'm definitely too old for that now. But it's just as nice, honestly, it's just as nice to hand out the candy and kind of become the next generation of people to do like that or create that nice experience for kids, because I had that nice experience growing up.
just some American traditions that are actually kind of nice. We don't have many. I'm still trying to get part of my costume. Oh no. Well it's Wednesday, so you have about half a week to get it. So you're not out of time. But it's also kinda cutting it close. So I hope you can get it before Sunday. tomato. <laughs> I have school and homework to do. Oh, gross. Are you still in school? Right now? I think you're an hour behind me, so it might be possible, but I wouldn't think so. for a second. behind. Yeah. I have so many friends who live, like online friends, who live in different countries. So I try my best to like memorize um, different time zones. Like who is where. At least like how many hours ahead or behind they are in relation to me. That kind of helps me remember better. But I still sometimes get it mixed up. But if it's like one or- it's usually like all or nothing, so if someone's like one or two hours away from me, I can usually remember because that's a bit easier. Or I have some friends who live on like the complete opposite side of the planet and then those people are like exactly 12 hours difference, right? And that's also easy to remember because it's like, okay, we're at the same time only when I'm PM, you're AM and vice versa. But anything in between, I'm like, uh, six hours maybe? Seven? Who knows? I scream. No mouth, but yet I must scream. That's such an old meme now. <laughs> it's 
so weird how fast memes go in and out of style now. How many tomatoes? I mean, how many? <laughs> how many tomatoes? Candle? How many candles? Tomato? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> that was a mouth typo. If I ever, <laughs> if I ever said one. <laughs> Oh! Oh no! No! Stop! <laughs> no! No, that was a mistake. Oh my god. No! How <laughs> many tomatoes? 237 tomatoes. <laughs> That's a lot of tomatoes. Yeah, you're beating me now. I have 230. I made a new friend last night, just randomly. I think I got on just to check something real quick. And inadvertently, somebody was like, just some random person was in the home menu. And they wanted to talk, so we ended up finding each other. So I gave them some candles. Yeah, no, I'm behind. We can go home. <laughs> I always have to be obnoxious about it. Alright, we almost got all of the missions. We're not actually done with the missions yet, though. We have one more to do. Ooh, tomato's gonna collect early though. It's always interesting when it wants you to go to a different world. Normally it wants everything in the one world. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Not sure what happened there. Aw, moth. Hello, moth child. Okay, tomato. You seem a bit glitchy today. It's normally very hot, but we just got had a cold front blow through last night, so now it's in the 70s. I think it went back up to the 80s, so it's not even cold. I said that I'm on and off. Yeah, you did. My bad. I guess it just manifests itself. 
in odd ways. I guess if you close the application, you might automatically, or minimize the application, you might automatically let go and just sit down. I think for my phone it does that. But I think for other people it can be okay at times. Um, no big candles here. I think I'm just looking for this sweaty guy. Where's sweaty guy? I th think it's Sweaty guy, sweaty guy. Is it over on this side? Going to another app. Okay. That makes sense. Oh, no, you were just warning me you were going to another app. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, well, that's okay. Tomato can catch up with us again when they um, open this app again. That's all good. Okay. Sweaty guy. We're looking for a sweaty spirit. <laughs> He's somewhere around here. Somewhere in this level. Not that one. There's one um, in this cave area. is back. Whoa. Are you in here, sweaty guy? <coughs> Sir? <laughs> yes! I remembered. I didn't actually remember. I just guessed pretty well. Hello, sir. Uh, okay. Way over there. Hello, sir. Are we done? Yes. Yay! did it. We finished all of the missions for the day. Let's do you a little victory. That's not the one we just relived, but it's the victory one, so we're gonna use that one. I like the color of the trail here. It's like a pretty green for no reason. Everywhere else it's just like a white color. Whoops. Oh no. At the same time though, that means that Tomato missed that one. Uh, actually, we can just go home now. Because this is not where the big candles are. Um. Oh. That was interesting. <laughs> Had a moment. Alright. Huzzah! Oops. Aww, someone said happy Halloween. 
in a little boat. Cute. Yes! You know what this means. I have enough of these to buy the next tier. Let's do it. Ooh, I can get this blue outfit. Ooh. What does the blue outfit look like? Let's see. Ah, it's cute. I like all of these, honestly. This one looks like a Breath of the Wild outfit or like an Avatar The Last Airbender Water Tribe outfit. But the ones I have unlocked are this one and this one. The blue ones. Because, of course, I would go for the blue ones first. Um, but I'm gonna stick with the black one for now because it looks good with the... this cape. It's like fall colors cape. And I'm still very happy to have the blue outfits. Big candle time. I have no many I have no idea how many candles I'm gonna have once I get ten. We'll find out real quick. just a cleaning day. Um, and then I just got really distracted with... Um, I don't know if this happens to other people, but it happens to me a lot, and I think it's just an ADD thing. But I very easily get very like absorbed in conversations that I have with other people. And then I end up talking to people for, instead of like multitasking and talking to people and then doing productive stuff. Ooh, that was my knee. <laughs> so yeah, I end up a lot of times, if I'm in like a chat room with people, I'll just like keep a conversation going and then accidentally get sucked into it to the point where I forget to do things I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> and then I'm like, man, I have no time. Where did the time go? And it's like, no, I had the time. <laughs> I just utilized it very poorly. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get enough hearts to get that spooky chair, even though that's all it is, is just spooky. I still want it. That's the currency that gets me more than anything else though. Like I can get enough, if I bite the bullet and go ahead and just bite, uh, or just do Eden. Then I can get Eden candles. 
and I'm pretty good at grinding for the other stuff. But hearts... Hearts are just hard to come by. It's kind of an annoying currency, really. I think my kitty is at my door. Hang on. One second. I'm gonna let her in. petting her, but she doesn't purr very often, and even if you can get her to purr, she usually purrs very quietly, so I'm trying to get her to purr for you. No. <laughs> it's not happening. Don't step on my keyboard, please. No. Now she wants to be let out again. I think she's trying to tell me that she's ready to be fed. Are you hungry? <laughs> I said that and she looked at me immediately. I know you're hungry. I know. Later. you closer to six. You're like an hour ahead. You can wait an hour. You're not gonna starve. Yeah, you're not gonna starve. She's like, now she's well, now that I'm talking, she's looking at me. She's looking off to the side, like... I didn't... I didn't say anything. I didn't do anything. done the long race on stream is the real question. I might actually do it because I think they have been moving um, shiny boys around and I think there's one in the big race or the long race that I don't think I've ever gotten before. So yeah, I'm wanting to check it out now. Um, there's also going to be a traveling spirit tomorrow but it's the play fighting one I believe so um, that one I already have so thankfully I won't have to deal with that unless they have just an extra accessory which they very well might For a very short time, I would light all of these every day, or at least every day that I played this level. Now I'm like, that's too much work. <laughs> but I did it today. Yeah, I want to see if that spirit is here in my game, and or not spirit, but winged light. 
Very curious. as possible. Like, I know there's one down here. And I think I've already gotten it. Yeah, I have. But then there's one, like, over here? Maybe it's just in a different version that's on this side. Oh. Because I could have sworn. I saw... I was watching another streamer. And I saw it there and I was like, what? I don't remember one ever being there. But it was there. Maybe it is a regional thing then. I never really realized that there was variation between regions for this game. I think um, in that area too there's a traveling spirit out already. Arya, stop! She's going in my bag now. Or she's trying to. It's not open, so she can't actually get in there. <laughs> you can't fit in there anyways. You're too fat. You're fat! <laughs> Why do you have to instigate everything? She's a cat. Maria, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. She's actually listening to me. <laughs> yes. Are you hungry? Are you hungry? Oh my gosh, I'm just killing my child. My <laughs> my poor sky child. Are you hungry? You know what that means, don't you? She's smart. She knows some words. But I try to be very, um repetitive with her. So like almost every day before I feed her I ask her if she's hungry so now she knows that means she's gonna get food soon. Or if I say do you want a treat? She knows that that means she'll get a treat. Aria, stop. Aria. Oh my gosh. Stop. <sighs> Cats. No. <laughs> no. Don't want the cutscene. She's burrowing under a blanket right now. Or attempting to. Alright, where's the candle? That was close. Still not 10. I might change with that. Yep. <laughs> that did it. That's all it took. 
and we still have more candles to collect here, so we'll go ahead and do that too. And then I might call it early. I know I didn't get to play any other games. Which I've been kind of determined to finish Yoshi's Island. But even if I played that today, even if I started like two hours earlier, um, I wouldn't have been able to finish that game regardless. So I guess it doesn't matter. It's not that big of a deal. So yeah, we'll have... we will have played for about an hour. That's good enough. I don't always have super long streams anyway. So this is more like my MO, really. Why? Why are you stuck here? Thank you. No! Stop! Stop perching! She has successfully burrowed into a blanket and now she's completely covered. <laughs> now, now she's leaving. Another thing I will probably because I realized I never actually shared the um I have like a well I haven't really edited it really but um you know how you do what are you doing? Okay, she's just sitting there. You know how you have like um, starting screens and ending screens and then you have like intermediate screens that you put up when you're streaming as a like, hang on one moment while I pull up this thing. I have a new intermediate picture that's more exciting than just a black screen. So. I would like to share that art. I've commissioned a lot of people <laughs> to draw my uh, character. Although a lot of the stuff that I have now is really just um, really old commissions and I went back and I made sure to ask every single artist if it was okay that I used the art and they all said yes because they're all very nice pleasant people um, and of course I was like I will credit you and all of that and so yes they've all given me permission um, and I have them credited in my about page <laughs> but yeah um, Initially, I was never intending to use a lot of that art for anything, really. So, it's great that I can use it for something now. Because it's just been, like, a lot of commissions over the years, you know? I don't know, I started doing that when I was... I think maybe 19, I was like, oh, I can commission artists to draw stuff for me if I pay them. And that's like such a cool concept. Even now, even now that it's a thing. Ah, uh -uh, no. Stop. Don't claw the carpet. 
Um, so yeah, I will I'll show that before I go. But I'll still go back to the home menu and everything just to see if there's anything else. I don't think there's anything else to do there, but you never know. There was something. I don't know if... Okay, OP Pro sent me something. Thank you. We are on our way to getting 33 hearts. We can do that. If we can get to 33 before the next, I think, two weeks are up, maybe a week and a half, then we'll be golden. It'll be great. I will love getting the spooky chair. And I won't have to do anything for this spirit except maybe buy an accessory that hopefully doesn't cost any hearts. I think one of them did. And if that's the case, then I don't know. I guess I can just forget it with one or the other. I guess I'll just pick which one I want less. Uh-uh. No, stop. So, yeah, we'll figure it out. No, but here, let me get this drop this little intermediate screen real quick. Look how cute it is. It's so cute. I love it. The artist is uh Lamorgo. She's amazing. So I would absolutely recommend her if people want commissions. She's very fast and very good. Very good at art. And I've commissioned her a couple times before. So yeah, and I've just kind of been like a fan of her art for a while now. So like I will pass on and shamelessly promote people that I like. Anyways, let's go to the end screen. Here we go. And this one is by, I think, Enbu is their, um, their Twitter handle now. I think they changed their name to Enbu. It's like E-N-N-E-B-U. Also a very nice person. Also somebody that I've commissioned several times in the past. Um, and yeah, if you ever have any extra money, usually if I ever have any extra money, I throw it at artists and I'm like, I know you need help with something here. <laughs> I'll find something to commission you for. I'll try to think of something so I can pay you. Okay, and my cat is now um, throwing a bit of a fit because she wants her food, so I guess I'll go ahead and end this so that she can eat. And yep, my bad for not starting this stream sooner, but um, I think again tomorrow I'm going to try and stream more stream for longer than today and get some other stuff on in aside from sky so i'll be back tomorrow thanks for joining and have a nice rest of your day bye